Hydra. So this is a password cracking tool. With this Hydra tool we try using different username and passwords against a target to find out the correct credentials. Correct credentials mean to find out the correct username and password. Uh, so for this, for illustration, let's say we I'll be using, I'll, of course, I'll be using Kali Linux machine, but here I'm going to show that I will have Linux machine and then I will have the Windows 10. Let's say Windows 10 is a machine of some of my friends. And I, I have the due permission from that friend. So that's Windows 10 and Linux. And uh, so I run maybe some uh, scanning tool like Nmap. And using Nmap, I find out that there are some services running on this Windows 10. Let's say SSH service is running on this Windows 10 and Secure Shell service. Now, once I have found out that Secure Shell service is running there, I can try to log in into this system using this SSH. But then I need username and password. And now for that, I can create username and password and then I can try all those combination of user and passwords against this machine so that I can find the right user and password and then I can easily log in into this system. So it means I'll create a file with a list of usernames, then also create a file with list of passwords. And then I use this tool that is Hydra. So this user, I use this tool and then I ask this tool to please go and try to log in or try to find out the right combination of username and password. So once I have the right combination which works here, I can then just log in into this system using SSH. So after this theory, let's go and do this in, in, in Kali Linux machine. Okay, so now to demonstrate the use of this password cracking tool, Hydra. I have this beautiful Kali Linux machine and I also have Windows 10 machine. And now to first maybe to find out if there are some ports or services running on this Windows 10, we go to this terminal and we run some scanning tool and that is Nmap. We use Nmap and to run this Nmap, we need to know the IP address of this Windows 10 machine. And then for this, we go to command prompt and maybe I just shift to full screen yes so sorry for this oh, sorry for disturbance here yeah. so this is uh, uh, this my machine windows 10 i want to find out the ip address for this and you can see ip address is 192 168 66 and 141 so let's go back to our um, uh, kali linux and here and map 192 sorry uh, and map and then 192.168.66.141 I'm running this scanning tool to find out if there are some services running or that some ports are open there so it seems down if it's really up but blo uh, blocking our ping props try minus pn so let's say use this option with the nmap uh, so nmap and minus p and, and then give the IP address that is 192, 168, and then 66, 141. Press uh, 141 and press enter. And this is trying to scan the system Windows 10. And uh, this time you can see this, uh, we have got this result that host is up. And uh, there is some port, that port number is 22 using TCP protocol that is SSH service running on that. So it means on Windows 10, we found that secure shell service is running. Okay, but now secure shell is running, but uh, how to find out the username and password which might which might work there. So for that, we need to create uh, two files, one with username and second with passwords. And then we will use the Hydra tool to find out the right combination for this. So first we are going to create this maybe with pseudo privileges. I'm, I'm using nano editor to, to create the file with username. So username.txt and press enter and asking password. Yes, give password. And now we're here and we can create maybe maybe some random name DD and maybe networking newbie, maybe with some this newbie. So actually, uh, maybe I know my friend that he, he uh, can use these names in on our computers as a username and password. Just a guess.
okay so i have created some random and maybe you can see like newbie newbie one two three this is also possibility so after that i just save this file with the same name and get out of there with control x so we created this and if we want to see like um, if we have this file ready then we can just say username and dot txt to verify yes we have this file yeah so control x and we also have to create one more file that is for passwords so we can have any name of this file i'm giving the name is password dot txt and let's say i assume that the password will also be same like maybe maybe gd maybe networking maybe newbie maybe newbie one two three so i can write all the all my all of my guesses in the password list and then i save it with control o and i get out of uh, from this file with control x so that's a nano editor text editor so now i maybe we can see this file as well using nano and then i can say password password.txt enter and you can see here we have those names here so now we have both of the files ready now this is the time to use our hydra tool and to use hydra tool maybe we can also get help from kali linux we can say hydra minus h and press enter and you can see this has given us a lot of help which we can use when so it's always good practice to learn how to use this help so here this is syntax hydra and then minus l this is login means the username and then minus p that's the password okay that's p file name we can give here so maybe this is l file name and p file name for containing password and then there are other options as well okay so now we have this tool and now let's use this so how we use it there are some example you can see they have given example the uh, minor less user list and then maybe password we can give a file maybe so there are some other predefined files which we can also use but in our case we have this like in our case we will be using because we have these two files ready one with the username second with the password okay so maybe we, we use this and for this i'm going to say hydra and then first i give the list of username so that is user name if you remember we created this file and maybe i made a mistake here user and then we have this file with password so i give password and then finally i specify uh, the service the service which against which we want to uh, explore it so username password and yes the ip address of the machine so that is 192.168.66.141 and the service ssh so we found that ssh service is running on this machine and we are trying to find out are we are trying to crack that password using these uh, these word list yeah, i forgot here txt sorry password.txt yes now hopefully everything is ready and we just press enter and this will do i mean this will find out the right combination of username and password so press enter passwords not found maybe we made some mistake here password what what was the name of the files we created maybe we need to verify d-a-double-s-w-a-r-d and username.txt yes fine what mistake username.txt password.txt sorry yes yeah, sorry for this i forgot t here and enter now you can see it's, it's trying yes and this worked so just i forgot yet t sorry for that and you can see it says that on this port number 22 there are secure shell services running on this machine and the login login credentials are newbie and newbie so this is the username and this is a password so hydra tool crack the password of my friend's machine and now let's use now let's use this uh, with this might mean just just to verify that this is really working so this is windows 10 here that's windows 10 we found out that ssh services are running and then password is newbie newbie 
and now we are trying to enter in that in that windows machine using secure shell and for this we have command that is ssh and then we specify the username so he said this is the username we said new b and e w p i e new b and then we specify the ip address of that machine that is 192.168 and then 66.141 and that's it just we press enter and you can see now it says that are you sure you want to continue connecting we say yes we are sure press enter and now you can see it's asking for password and we found that password is newbie so again i'm writing here newbie and e w b i e this will not be shown here so press enter and as soon as you we press enter you can see we are in the c drive here in the newbie machine so newbie the desktop here so we enter in that uh, windows 10 machine so we first we run and map to find out the services and then we found out that SSH service is running and then we use Hydra tool to find out the right combination of user and password and now with the right uh, combination of user and password we are in this Windows Microsoft Windows 10 here and you can maybe verify with this looking at the IP address of this machine so for that IP config and press enter and you can see this IP address there yes 192.168.66.141 so that is the IP address of this Windows machine here you can verify this one so it means sitting at Kali machine now we are um, we have access the Windows 10 machine and that's due to Hydra that is Spice password cracking tool okay so this was I think this video on password cracking tool Hydra I hope that some of you may find it helpful and thank you, thank you very much for your time. Hope to see you in some other video.